Hey guys, uh, welcome to your singles love reading for Sagittarius for October 2023. You can apply this to your sun, moon, rising, Venus signs. So uh, we are going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys in love, uh, what kind of blocks and challenges are in love, and then we'll finish off through you to see uh, what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on. If there's anyone new coming towards you, apply this to your own unique situation. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Sagittarius people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Particular. If you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my videos post or when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok and also on Instagram, the links for those are in the description box below. I do post readings on there too. Also, quick note that there are people impersonating me on TikTok, asking people for money. Um, that's not me. If you do come across these individuals, uh, report them, okay? So tell me about single Sagittarius and love. What's going on with single Sagittarius and love? What are single Sagittarius' blocks and challenges in love for October 2023? Sun, moon, rising, Venus sign for single Sagittarius. Ace of Wands, okay, and the King of Pentacles. Uh, you know, I feel like a lot of you guys are focusing on your passions right now. Yeah, just focusing on your career goals, your finance goals. Uh, some of you guys could be starting a new business. I don't know. For some of you guys, some of you guys are right now in this very moment are just okay with like doing what nice dance, having fun, meeting people, but not really looking for anything serious or any sort of commitment right now, okay? I've already done like three of these at the third one. It seems like everyone's just like, you know, okay with being single, being alone right now, enjoying it. And, you know, and a lot of you guys are in this like very non-committal energy, which is okay. That's perfectly fine. Okay, the world and the Knight of Cups. You know, Sagittarius, this is so interesting. One of the things I'm getting here is that I feel like you are convinced that the person that you're meant to be with does not live in the place that you live. This person could live in another city, another town, a different state, a different country. But, you know, I do feel like a lot of guys may be traveling around a lot. And perhaps this is where you're going to meet your new love or something like that. You know, I, I'm getting Europe. Yeah, you know, I'm getting Europe like Spain. I'm getting Portugal. I'm getting Italy or something like that. I'm also getting like Germany, Austria, Denmark. Okay. Some of you guys could be planning on physically moving to Europe, okay? The Knight of Wands here and a ton of pens. Yeah, you guys are not really looking, looking for commitment at this time here. I just feel like a lot of you guys are really just focusing on your careers. Yeah. Um, more so, I feel like you guys are okay with like, you know, like, you know, one night stands or even just like friendships or short-term relationships at this time. I, I don't feel like you guys are looking for anything really serious long drawn out and like i said that's perfectly fine that's perfectly fine the ace of wands the justice card Libra energy the uh king of pentacles and the full ear yeah i just feel like you guys are not looking for commitment at this time here um you know one of the things i'm getting here is i feel like at this time you guys decided that you might feel like at this time your life is pretty balanced, pretty stable. You're not really ready to take on anyone new at this time. This is so interesting. I feel like someone here had a pet, a pet that passed away. And I feel like that goes the same for the pet. I feel like someone here really wants a new pet, but they're not ready for it either. Because I feel like someone here is just really enjoying their freedom here. Okay? So uh, the, the world. The five of wands. The uh, knight of cups. And the Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, you're just really not ready to invest in love right now. Um, you're just not ready for all the things that comes along with being a in a relationship. So, you know, I just feel like, yeah, I just feel like you guys are just really enjoying your freedom. Yeah, uh, you know, sort of like free to be you, to do you, that sort of thing. And a ton of cups here and a ton of pentacles. And the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy. 
You know, I just feel like you're just waiting for the right time. You're just waiting for the right time for it to happen. Is this a blockage? I don't think so. I feel like you guys are actively and consciously deciding this for yourself. You know, I don't feel like there's anything, you know, I feel like you guys are staying on top of your own triggers, any sort of pain, any sort of hurt, any sort of, um, you know, painful experience that you've went through. I feel like you've sort of like taken care of that. Okay. So, um, Let's see, what else do we have for Sagittarius? What else does Sagittarius need to know, look out for, work on? Is there anyone new coming into a single Sagittarius' life for October 2023? Nine of Wands and the Ace of Cups. <coughs> Excuse me. Two of Wands and the Seven of Wands, two plus... Uh, uh, seven is nine too. So we have two nine of wands here. Um, I do feel like maybe you guys are a little guarded here. Yeah. Um, you know, I do feel like when it comes to love right now, I, I don't feel like you guys are really open to it or that you guys are really emotionally invested into this. I just feel like you guys are just man right now taking care of yourself, trying to manifest the reality that you want for yourself at this time here, which is completely okay. Uh, you know, maybe there's some sort of residual pain and hurt that you are still dealing with that you're still trying to work through here uh you know i do feel like maybe your heart space is a little closed off to love right now in this very moment here because i do feel like someone here uh hurt you broke your heart cheated on you left you out in the cold lied to you here and i feel like this is something that you're still trying to find closure on so i feel like you're taking your time here yeah you're taking your time you're not rushing here okay so i feel like like i said right now you're enjoying your freedom you're doing you, you're working on yourself here. You're still trying to find closure in regards to a past situation that you dealt with here that was very, 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 very painful, very, very, very hurtful here, okay? I, I get the sense that some here turned their back on you here, went towards the other side of the grass and was breadcrumbing you, was leading you on. Um, you know, it could be a situation that this person is trying to come in for some sort of reconciliation here. But, you know, in terms of a reconciliation, I, ju I, ju I just feel like that's a no-go for you. Yeah, I, I just feel like you just want to continue moving forward, just doing you here, and just focusing on your healing and your manifestations here. Okay, so we have the Page of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, and the Three of Swords, the Five of Pentacles, the Seven of Swords, Judgment, and the Death card here. You know, I do feel like you guys are just, you know, talking to people talking to people on dating websites, you know, talking to people on like apps and stuff like that. Uh, but in terms of someone serious that you're dealing with here, I don't really see it in this very moment. Okay. Like I said, I feel like you're focusing on your own goals at this time here. And I feel like a lot of you guys are definitely traveling here. Uh, and like I said, I feel like you guys are under the impression that you know, the person that I'm meant to be with might not be in the place that I live in right now. They might be somewhere else. And I feel like you guys might go out there exploring here just to see what's out there outside of your neighborhood, okay? Or, or your uh, state. Uh, yeah, so um, Sagittarius, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.